Good morning, beginners. Who is ready to count? Who is ready to count? What is mathematics? The art of, what is our long word? Computation. Computation, very good. Okay, so we're gonna count, but today we're not gonna count by one when we go one, two, three, four, five, six. We're not gonna count like this. Today we're gonna be like a little frog. Who wants to be like a little frog and skip around? Yeah, do you know how frogs, if you were here, I would ask you to come to the front and skip around, right? And show us how the frogs jump. So maybe you can do that at home and show your mommy how a frog jumps, right? Okay, so a frog jumps and when you jump, you go further, right? If you're just walking, you go slow. But if you jump, then you're going faster. You're going further away and you might be able to skip certain things. And that's what we're gonna do today. We're gonna skip count. We're gonna skip count from, I don't know if you can see right there, from number, right? We're gonna start with number two. Okay, wait, wait, Miss Sarah's trying to <laughs> see how to do this. Okay, number two, right? You're gonna go from number two all the way to number 30, and we're gonna skip count. Can you help me do that? Let's see if we can do it together, okay? So, let me show you. We're gonna start with two, and then we're not gonna say three. We're gonna say four out loud. So we're gonna go like this, two, and we're gonna skip, boop, three, we're gonna skip it. We're not gonna say it, and then we're gonna say four. Then we're gonna skip five, and we're gonna say six. Now what's the next number? Seven, we're gonna skip it. We're gonna skip seven and go to eight. Now what's the next number? Nine? That's right, we're gonna skip nine. We're not gonna say it. We're gonna say 10. And then what is the next number? 11? We're not gonna say 11, we're gonna skip it. We're gonna say 10 and then we're gonna say we're gonna jump like a frog. Woohoo! Skip over 11 and say 12 out loud. Okay? And then from 12, we're gonna skip the next number. Ooh. And then we're gonna say 14. Okay? And we're gonna keep going like this all the way to 30. So you're like a little frog. You go, rip it, and you're jumping to four. And then you say, rip it, and you're jumping over five to six. And then you say rip it. And then you're jumping to eight. And then you say rip it. And then you're jumping to 10. See, every time you say rip it, it's like you're skipping a number. You're skipping the next number. You're jumping higher over it. Go to the next number. Okay? So let's do it together. Two, rip it. Four, rip it. Six, rip it. Eight, rip it. 10, Rip it. 12, rip it. 14, rip it. 16, rip it. 18, rip it. 20, rip it. 22, rip it. 24, rip it. 26, rip it. 28, rip it. 30. Did you see that? How we jump, we skip count? Yeah, we skip counting. All right, so now let's say it without saying rip it. So it's gonna go faster. You ready? Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30. Very good. All right. So now that we know how to count by twos, and you can repeat counting by twos with your mom or your dad several times. But now that we know how to count by twos, Miss Sarah gave you some little puzzles. There are long strips in a in a in uh, a little bag. They're long strips and they're puzzles. 
Let me see if I have one here if I can show you. They're like this. There are those long strips like this. And you can see that there are numbers at the bottom. You see all the numbers at the bottom? You have to put them in order and skipping count, skipping count, skip counting by two. Can you do that? So you're gonna, you're gonna put them flat on the table. And it's hard for Missy Hart to show you. Let me see if I can do this. Let me see if I can do this. Okay, so for instance, Miss Sarah has one right here. You see, this is, this one is harder than the one that you have. It goes it goes way past thirty. But we're gonna start. I don't know if you can see. We're gonna start with two, right? Because remember, that's how we're learning to count by twos. Then we're gonna try. What comes afterwards when we count by two? Remember, two, four. So Miss Sarah found four, and now I can put it right here. Four, two, four. Then you have six, two, four, six. Then it's eight, two, four, six, eight. Do you see that? Two, four, six, eight. Okay, very good. Two, four, six, eight. 10, let's see if we can find 10. Can we find 10, is it this one? Oh no, I see it, it's right here. 10, two, four, six, eight. So you have to make sure that you put them straight and that they don't move because it's gonna make a picture. And you're gonna, it's like making a little puzzle. Okay, and it's gonna start making a picture. Two, four, six, eight, ten. 12, then you have 14. Look at the picture that's starting to appear. What is that? 16, 18, and we have 20. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22. Where is 22? Can you see it? 22, 24. Where is 24? Right here. 24. Then you have 26. 26. Then you have 28. Here, 28, and then you have 30. And we could keep on going further. This one goes further. I don't think yours do, but this one goes further. So let's finish it up. 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40. And the last one is 42. Now what do you see? You see this little girl? She's playing puppet golf. It's miniature golf and she has to to push the ball all the way inside the windmill. You see it's called putt putt golf golf. All right, so beginners, you have a puzzle to make. And so you need to try your best to count by twos. Okay, can you do that? Try to count by twos? All right, very good. Awesome. Take a picture of your puzzle when you're done so you can send it to me and I can see that you did it. Okay, we'll see you later, beginners.